hey, Spring LaFay, Simple Tarot. Okay, this is a reading for the sign of Taurus. Um, there will be an extended at the end. Um, the extended will, I will take some advice cards for you going forward. I'll also take some cards for each zodiac sign in case you are dealing with any of them. Um, and that link will be at the, the end of the reading. So, we're going to start up here. This is a love reading, by the way, if I did not mention that. We have three beautiful cards. You want to look at those? Close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful. You can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in. Give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Know that you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires. Surrender. At times we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives. Let go and all will work out. So there's something you need to let go of. Could be something from the past. Um, could be memories. Could be um, a relationship that maybe you're clinging on to. Um, we've got one romance angel. Ah, look in there. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. So what's holding on to you? What's holding you back? You need to think about that. And we got three of these. We've got um, cassette, the snake, and photograph. Okay, cassette. Outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. So what what are you replaying? Are you replaying something, uh, a memory, that uh, maybe you need to learn something from it and let it go, put it to rest? Then we have the snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious. Look over your shoulder, the other woman. So, you know, that's that's pretty, pretty outright with that one. <laughs> there ain't much I can say on that except for um, there may be someone that, you know, you need to look out for. I mean, that's pretty out front with it. Then we have photograph. Looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, make new memories. So, you need to figure out what those mean to you. Okay, the tarot, let's get on into it. We have got the Queen of Pentacles, the Hermit, Page of Pentacles. Okay, you got someone, this is not you, this is someone else. This is someone that can help you to heal whatever's going on with you, but you've got to release whatever's holding you back first. Um, this is someone that has a lot to offer. It's, it's almost like you've got a lot in common with this person. Um, Page of Pentacles is here because it's, it's almost like they're already offering you something. Now, this is about, okay, this is a feeling like walking away, walking away from something. Okay, that's what you need to do. You need to walk away from, whatever's holding you back, you need to leave it in the past. You need to cut, with the Queen of Swords, you need to cut it out of your life, let it go, so that you can move forward with whoever this is that is uh, coming into your life or is already in your life that's very healing energy. Um, that has a lot to offer. Now, um, you know, as far as signs are concerned, I'm seeing uh, Virgo here. I'm seeing um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and I'm also seeing uh, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. That's who I'm seeing. So, yeah. Um, in the extended, like I said, I will take some advice cards for you, but this is pretty clear and cut. You need to let something go. There's something that you're holding on to that is holding you back. Basically, it. Uh, so there's something you need to let go of. And, you know, in the extended, I'll take some advice for you. 
Um, so yeah, give it a thumbs up. Please do subscribe. The link for the extended will be in the description box below. Until next time, bye.